Hello and welcome to Wise Man Channel. Today I'm gonna repair my Blue Shark module, or rather, I'm not gonna repair it. I'm gonna actually swap it out with a new one, and I just want to show you how it looks like when I do it. It doesn't take too long, so bear with me. With this setup, I have my spare uh, Blue Shark. Let me just open it up and take it out. This one here has the flat FPC connector that we need to take on first. Usually it's here as a cover uh, for this little heat uh, transparent tape, which you need to take off. It's usually blue. So I've already taken off and taken off this one a couple of times. So I don't have that cover there anymore, but you know it now. We also have uh, the prop mark that I actually broke. I don't know if you can see it here a little bit better like that. Yeah, right there. Let us see what we can do. Open up the case. And in order to get loose this FPC cable, it's much easier if you take away the antennas first. So let's do that. Now the antenna's off, and we see that it still can't reach it, and we need to take it up. You take the guitar strummer thing, and you start on this end here. And you start about there, and squeeze it in quite hard, and you go along the edge, and work your way around the corner, and all the way up there, and then it's more or less open. It's just that the tape that's connecting it to the heat sink underneath is kind of sticky. So you need to be wiggling a little bit in order to get it off. Like that. So we fold it over like this. We fold it over. Now we get access to this FPC connector. I don't know if you see it well. I just need to clip it open like that. And off it goes. And the old one goes here. And you can just start putting on the new one. You put it in nice and easily in there. Usually one of them nice and easily. Flip down the little securement gate or whatever it's called. And then just squeeze it together again. Like that. With that on place, you can now put back all the screws. With that in place, the antenna is fixed. Remember to put the Q on 7 and the 125. Of course, that's what you're most likely going to be using. We can see if it works by turning on the power. And it does, and the Bluetooth start flashing its light there. So smash that like button, and have a good one. 